Hello, it's me, Debbie Hilly. And somebody on Grooming Smarter had pointed this dryer out before. And I wanted to buy one. Didn't have the money. Got the money available this week. So I ordered one from Amazon and it came pretty quickly. And it's the DUZ hands-free dryer. Um, so far I'm loving it. I don't have room for a stand dryer in here, so I haven't had one, and whenever I've wanted to dry a dog by hand, I've had to use the brush dryer or just a regular hair dryer with a stand. And this has got, this actually is going to probably replace both of those. It has a touch power button, three fan speeds, which that's hot, that's medium, that's high. and three heat settings from all the way off. So it has four hand settings, or four heat settings. So it'll be off, low, medium, and high. So you have a lot of versatility here. The hose is very flexible, so you can put it right where you want it. And that's on high, so I can actually get him done. And I'll show you how easy this works. He has been blown out and put up here because his face is wet. The rest of them's fairly dry, most of the way dry. But this through here is pretty wet. And you can see it works just like a stand dryer, except that it takes up a whole lot less space. It also comes with a wall mount, so it can be put on the wall and be gotten out of your way. It is an amazing little dryer. I really like it. It's very gentle and that my hands don't get hot underneath it. And if my hands are not going to get hot, the dogs are not going to overheat and the hair is not going to be damaged. This is one of my favorite puppies in the world. He comes every two weeks. And I've always tried to finish him with a hand dryer just to get the conditioner worked in real well and the hair to be brushed out completely straight because he's not a shizu, he is a shapu. And yes, he is one full coated little dog right here. But like I said, it allows you I know Colby, you're being silly. It allows you to move it wherever you need it. It could be pointed at his feet. Which they're a little bit wet. Or Anywhere that you might need it, you can use it on just one spot, you can use it on the whole, you know, all over. If you can use it to assist in drying while you're using a force dryer, you can point it at your faces while you're doing the other, because it's such a slight amount of hair blowing, or air blowing. I mean, if that's what you get, you can see how the hair's moving, but that's really about it. You're getting just enough to lift the hair so you can get underneath and get dried. It costs, I'm not even, gonna, I'm not sure, I can't remember, under 200 bucks, I think I paid 179 for this one through the warehouse, because somebody bought it and returned it, and if it was you, I appreciate it, because it's never been, it doesn't look like it had ever been out of the box. I always check the warehouse deals, but I think it's 199 you know how warehouse deal, or excuse me, how Amazon changes up its pricing all the time, you'll never know for sure until you go to buy it. But it's a very nice little dryer. Now, for drying, he, like I said, he got dried pretty good and then put up here for me to finish drying them. But you can, like a small Yorkie, a Maltese. I did a full coated elderly Maltese with it yesterday. Took me no time at all and she looked gorgeous. I'm really in love with this little thing. Um, I really like the fact that it is so quiet that it is so easy to work with and so affordable. I mean, I can take them home. I can do my hair with it. And that was actually what I told my husband was if I can't use it on a dog, at least I'll be able to style my hair because I won't have to hold the dryer at the same time I'm drying my hair. So that's my product review number one of this little dryer. And right through here, and I guess I'll finish it up this way. He really seriously hates having a fan in his face. So there we go down to the lowest amount. And it's hardly moving it at all, but it is putting out nice warm air there. So I can get in here with the brush 
and just put right above his eyes, straightened out and dried. And because the under his eyes is still a little bit wet and I don't want to pull him in there while it's drying, I'm just going to put this on him like this for just a couple of minutes and work it with my fingers a little bit just to make sure that that area is dry. I'm going to put his hair up in a minute. But there you have it. The DUZ, which I would imagine is DUZ, premium hands-free dryer. I'm in love with it. Thank you to whomever suggested we take a look at it. Um, I'll do some more videos with it later as soon as I get somebody else to dry. Have a great day, y'all.